All right, so we just got a nice little surprise from Matt Reeves. We got a link to the website, Rada La Dada. I still can't pronounce it right from seeing it in the Batman movie, but nevertheless, there was a website in the Batman movie where you had to solve these riddles or the Batman and Commissioner Gordon had to solve these riddles, but basically you had to solve these riddles and then it ended up unlocking the deleted scene from the movie where Batman is interrogating Joker, trying to figure out more about the loose serial killer who we know as the Riddler. So. I'm gonna show you some footage of me trying to figure this riddle out. It was not very successful. I am terrible at riddles, but right after that, we're gonna jump right into my reaction of this footage, but here you go. Uh, proceed, yes. Uh, hold on, let me try and figure this out. Here we go, three right answers and justice will be your reward. Once you've been set up, it hits you at the end straight on. I don't know the answer! I'm gonna have to cheat for this real quick, hold on. What, I, I didn't expect this. Hey, does somebody have the answers in here? Is it, am I gonna get freaked out by something? What are the answers, Twitter? Using your mind is more rewarding than looking at the end notes. I'm trying to look it up. I don't know the answer, help me. Time? I know I'm not as smart, stop making fun of me. Okay, come on, Some, somebody on Twitter give me the answers. Ah, uh, they said I got it and then it said wrong. Almost our anniversary, huh? There's a serial killer. I want to respect it. Dang, the Joker is all jacked up, man. He's really messed up. Compared to previous iterations. Look at those scars. Oh, Crazy. I know who he is. Oh. Who is he? He's a nobody. Wants to be somebody. Interesting. The mayor. The commissioner. You think his motive is political? Oh, no, no, no. This is very, very personal. He feels these people have all wronged him. Probably goes way back. Unhealed wounds, stolen much money. Why is he writing to me? Maybe he's a fan of yours? <laughs> he looks so creepy. Maybe Even from just a silhouette. Maybe you're the main course. Any theories? Not yet. Really? You're normally so ahead of the curve. <laughs> but something is different this time. Hmm. This is very upsetting to you. Let's get back to him. Why? You are so much more fun. I'm not here to talk about me. What are you here to talk about? I want to know how he thinks. You know exactly how he thinks. Have you read this file? 
You two have so much in common. Mask Avengers. <gasps> so he's even more righteous. <laughs> oh, you're afraid he makes you look soft. <laughs> This is super fascinating, man. I tell you what I really think. I think you don't really care about his motives, whether he loves or hates you. I think somewhere deep down, you're just terrified. Cause you're not sure he's wrong, huh? Mm. You think they deserved it, huh? Oh my goodness, man, you he looks awful. They deserved it. <laughs> that was that's kind of creepy, man. Wow, that's a creepy Joker. I'm not gonna lie. My goodness. I don't really know what to make of this footage. I mean, it didn't really feel like it was going to add too much more to the movie, honestly, but I don't know. I kind of would have rather have seen this than see the weird little cameo that they did for the Joker in the fourth act. I thought that that was way worse of a reveal than this was actually this would have been much more interesting because it's much more early in the movie it would have introduced this joker character and actually probably got the crowd way more pumped up and on the edge of their seats because the joker in this clip right here was super i i don't even know how to say it he was creepy I, i've never been creeped out by the joker the joker has always kind of kept me on the edge of my seat especially with like heath ledger and jack nicholson to a degree but this one was just like borderline terrifying in my opinion he was just gross to look at he was just overall just kind of i don't know just feel like a creeper i can't really describe it better than that obviously we just got the silhouette for most of this it was mostly blurred out so we couldn't see his face but we finally got to see his full face head on and yeah, like I said, he's just jacked up. I've never seen the Joker this messed up before in a movie. I really like how he's stringing Batman along. He's giving him little clues as to what the insights to the serial killer is. We know as the Riddler. And I don't know, I just like how he's just toying with Batman. He's giving him little nuggets of information, but he's at the same time trying to mess with Batman because that's what the Joker does. He's really like into making Batman's life just miserable in a lot of ways, but he also wants Batman to stick around because he likes messing with him so much. I don't know, I just want repeat it again i would have way rather have had this deleted scene in the movie rather than that little tiny clip that we got toward the end of the movie this was significantly better to me but anyways guys let me know what you think down in the comments below i say go watch this for yourself definitely go look at matt reeves twitter page click the website and try and figure out these riddles i still can't figure them out even even after looking through the twitter feeds and trying to figure it out i can't find the answers to it so let me know down in the comments below what you guys think but anyways that's it we'll see you next time